I am going to do some Charleston modeling for American style. If you'd like to see what that's all about, stick around. I'll show you how it works. I have all my tiles out, my rack, and I'm going to grab 13 random tiles. If you take four from each side and have five in the middle, you know you have enough tiles. Then I'm going to grab a mock Charleston. So you're going to get three tiles, six high, and that's going to mimic the Charleston. It's not an exact science, but it's really good for practice. Here we go. No jokers. Does that ever happen to you? So we're going to do uh, jokers, flowers, winds, and dragons. We have no dragons or flowers or jokers. So this is going to be interesting. I like to set my tiles up in order and in suit. Look at that. Talk about a spread. We don't even have a multiple. So I'm thinking give away the West and we're going to play a pair hand of some kind. Pairs and singles, singles and pairs. Let's see here. Here's two. Let's save all our two, four, six, eight. That's it. Look how many odds we have though. So I think this is going to be odds. We're going to save every one of them. It looks like we have mm, more big odds than little odds. I don't know. We might be in between. So let's throw, let's throw two eight west. We got all odds and I think we've got a multiple now in there. Okay. So let's see how this shakes out. Look at all those odds. So we could do, let's save the seven for a like number option. Here's a seven, nine. We actually could do maybe one, three, five, seven, nine, or even a year hand if it comes in. Let's save all the big odds. So we've got five, seven, nine. We'll save the one for a potential uh, year category. And here we have some tiles that we could pass. One, three, six. And we got a three bam. If we get the five bam, we could play one, three, five, seven, nine in one suit. Yeah, that three is not going to help too much. So let's pass three, four, six. We got a one bam and a seven crack. So that potential like number or year category might work. And here we have tiles to pass. Let's give up on the five dot. Now let's give up on the nine band, uh, nine dot. That way we, we won't get stuck with passing like numbers with the next pass if we happen to get good tiles. It's always good to think about the next pass. Okay, so now we have some, oh, a white dragon. We could go for the year category maybe. Let's go ahead and give up on the mixed suit big odds. Okay, we got a one dot, five crack west. Okay, let's give that. Got to give the joker back. 
We've got red and green. All right, let's see. I think either like numbers or the year category. That's going to be a dangerous pass right there. But I think it's worth it because we could even go for the big hand, the big year hand with all these dragons and the right suits, cracks and bams. Let's pass those three for optional cross. Oh, we got ones. Oh my goodness. Look at this nonsense. <laughs> all over the place that's okay though that happens sometimes so like numbers with ones or like numbers with sevens or a year hand and we have two discards before we have to choose all right let's try it again that was weird and i'll tell you sometimes you get hands like that it's good to practice for those situations Okay, Mock Charleston's ready to go. We got a joker this time. Okay, we got a joker and some wins, a dragon, and then here's our numbered suits in order. I think it's the best way to start. So then you can see Category, end, suit, end. Um, just all different patterns versus putting like numbers together like this. I just think this is much harder to see what you have if they're all mixed up. I think it's best to start with them in order and in suit. Then you can rearrange as you go. So obviously we've got consecutive. One, two, three. One, two, three. We do have a south, but I don't think that south is going to help with the one, two, three situation. We could do two, three, two, three, four, maybe. So consecutive for sure. Let's break up the south right now and then maybe pass south red nine bam we're playing consecutive category we got a one now we did get this dragon we could do a one two three with opposite dragons maybe we can get that red back let's go ahead and pass let's get rid of the one instead of passing two wins north and south together Oh, we got another green. Let's go ahead and go with one suit. And that way we can make not pass two wins. Okay. pass put the joker back oh we got two fours now oh if we get a five dot we could play one through five in one suit or here we already have two three four with opposite dragons at this point we can give up that one really so we could either do one two west or one three west i think that's what we should do Oh, and then we get the five. Isn't that how it works? You give up on one hand and then it comes in. 
let's save it and pass these. And we got another five. Okay, let's pass one blind for optional cross. Maybe we'll get that one dot back. Or the red, either one will be great. We get two. Oh, we didn't get either one. That's all right. So we're four away from, well, we, we don't know which one we're gonna, we would keep either. So the consecutive hand under consecutive run, last one on the card, concealed hand, two, three, four, or three, four, five with opposite dragons. We have two discards, really four discards once we decide. If we draw the one, we might even get rid of the green and go for the one through five. Consecutive hand, the first one. All right, let's do this one more time. There's the Mock Charleston, and here's our drawn tiles. No jokers, but we do have some flowers and a dragon, another dragon, a pear. That's nice. We've got lots of um, evens. Oh, look at sixes, like numbers like numbers with dragons right there. But to give ourselves options, because the multiples are in the sixes, I'm thinking we should consider a consecutive, maybe six, seven, six, seven, eight. That's the wrong eight though. We should just go ahead and give it up. Let's play like numbers. That's good. One of each suit, even odd. All right, now let's see here. I don't, even though these are consecutive, they're not the right suit for options. So I think we should keep going with the like number category. Got to put the joker back. Okay, now this seven we might keep. Oh no, look, we got fours. That's not gonna help. Okay. I think we should go ahead and give up or continue with the like number and give up the seven. I'd rather do that than pass like numbers. Oh my goodness. Now the threes, we could maybe do a three six, three six nine, but we'd have to throw away the flowers. I think we should stick with the plan. Oops. Okay. Now we can keep that seven for an option. Oh my gosh! But that is that is terrible. I would not pass. That's te that's a terrible pass. I would break it up. It's all going to be a bit risky. There's a keeper, finally. Goodness sake. That's been rough going. Let's pass the 9-2 east. Oh, another keeper. And a white dragon. We have two tiles here to pass. So if we were to play like numbers, the dragon that we need would be, we've got the dots and cracks, so we need the green. So it's the opposite dragon from the other two suits. So if we pass that, 
Let's give up the red because if we happen to draw jokers, we could maybe even go for a quint. I like to leave my options open. Let's pass these. And I don't think there's anything in here that's going to help us, but we'll go through the motions. Finish the task. Discards. So we're th four away. Four away from really five away, actually. Five away, but I would keep this six for as long as possible. And maybe even the white, just for options. Okay. Let me know what you think about Charleston modeling for American style. I think it's a great exercise. I hope you give it a try and come back and let me know what you think. Write it in the comment section. And if you haven't joined my channel yet, click subscribe so that um, you'll get the bell. Once you do click subscribe and you can click that bell and get notification of when I post new videos. Give me a thumbs up if you did enjoy this. And maybe I'll see you at the next Charleston modeling. Between now and then, may all your picks be keepers.